Hi guys, and thank you for purchasing our open air rig from BitcoinMerch.com. My name is Idan, and today I'm gonna show you how to assemble it once you receive it in the mail. You're gonna receive two boxes. One will be the open air case. The second box will have the power supply. It will also have the GPUs separate and the memory separate. The reason we ship it separate is to protect it during shipping. Those are sensitive electronics and you're gonna have to assemble it once you receive all the parts. We made sure to install all the software necessary per your request. So when you receive it, once you assemble it, it's ready to go. Now it's time to install the power supplies. We got three for this specific rig. You might get two or you might get even more. So it depends on your rig. So we're gonna start installing the power supplies like this. Notice that this one has a cable already plugged in on this side. Then we're gonna use two screws. Do not over tight, just tight it a little bit like this. Perfect, let's go do the next one. I'm now installing the second power supply. I'm now installing the third power supply. This one does not have the motherboard plugged in yet. For the power supply that's on the left, we're gonna now plug in the motherboard cable, do not forget, like this. Now our motherboard has power. We are now gonna install the SSD right in the front. Make sure those two are aligned, and once you tighten them, it will lock. And do not over tighten. We are now gonna plug the SATA cable from the motherboard to the SSD. We will now install the cables for each power supply. As you can see, this is shows power supply one, PSU one. This is also power supply one. Most important thing is to plug the CPU power to the correct place, because if you plug it the wrong place, you might burn the CPU, okay? So this is very crucial. CPU power goes to CPU. So we're gonna start with that. This is why it's labeled different, okay? Don't plug it anywhere else. The rest of the cables will go to PCIe slot and two of them will go to peripheral, okay? So let's start with the peripheral. I'm gonna plug two of them. And the rest of the cables will be plugged in to PCIe. We will now install the cables for power supply two. Again, you know, we're gonna install the peripherals first on the left and then the rest will go to PCIe. Now we're installing PSU three or power supply three cables, same way. Now we're gonna plug in the SSD power to the SSD. Now we're gonna install the risers. We have PSU1 power supply one risers, and here is the cables coming out of the first power supply. Okay, let's plug that in. And they sit like this for now. Now we're gonna install power supply two risers, which is three of them. Now we're gonna install the three risers for power supply three. Now we're gonna install the risers to the motherboard like this, one by one, all eight of them. So here is the CPU power cable. We're gonna plug that in as well. So we're now gonna install the first GPU. Make sure that this plastic piece is all the way to the back. We're gonna install the riser to the GPU like this, and we're gonna lock it in by clicking it back, all right? We're now gonna install it with two screws. We're now gonna install power for the first graphics card with the first power supply. We're now gonna install all eight cards the same way. We are now finished installing all eight cards. The next step is to install the front panel with the fans, plug in the power and turn it on. Let's go. We are now installing the front fan panel. We have to make sure this little piece aligns and goes inside. It can be a little hard. Just pay attention and be careful. And we're gonna slide all the way down both sides. Now we're gonna put the cap on and we're gonna tighten the screws on both sides. We are now gonna install the fans. Each fan has its own plug and the power supplies have the plugs for it. It's a little bit hard to do. Sometimes you need some force, but just be patient and it will work. Now that we finished building the whole rig, it's time to power it on. We installed those power cables. They come with your rig. 
We install them on all the power supplies. We must power those two power supplies before we power power supply number one. So we plug those in. Now we're gonna turn it on. That's our first step. Second step is to power power supply number one. Now make sure to install an ethernet cable. You have the keyboard and mouse and you have a VGA for your screen. NiceHash will now start on its own and it will start mining right away. Remember to switch the NiceHash address to yours. Let me show you how. We're gonna go to settings and simply change this wallet address to your Bitcoin address and then you get paid. Now we're gonna set up the mining clocks by opening the Precision app from right here and then we're gonna click on number two, load and apply. And now all the settings are ready to go. We are all done with the rig. Make sure to use three different circuits on power because it might trip it. So it takes a lot of power, of course. So it's ready to go. Thank you so much for purchasing from bitcoinage.com. If you have any questions, you can go to our website and click on the contact us page or you can contact us on an email sales at bitcoinage.com. Thank you. See you guys next time. Happy mining. Bye-bye.